Hello everyone, today let's discuss about a new payment integration that we have implemented in FormGet and that is Stripe. So yes, apart from PayPal, now you have got the Stripe payment integrations as well. So let's get started. Let's create a form. Let's put up some form field and let's see how exactly the payment settings are going to work. Okay. So over here, I've got this form. All right. Name, email, message. Over here, I've provided some business plans and over here, I've got the price. Now I'm just going to click over here on next step. Cool. My form is ready. Okay. Let's move to our dashboard and over here you will find the setting option so I'll just click over here on settings I'll go here to payment setting and from here I'll choose stripe now as soon as I will choose stripe it will ask me to connect so I'll just click here on connect So I've already got an account so I'm just going to click over here on sign in and I'm just going to put up the details here all right it's connected you can see it's written connected now let's move down to payment option US dollars that's fine and over here we have got this assigned prices this is the base amount as I told you in my previous videos that this is an amount that is like almost fixed every time so I just want to keep the base price as zero I don't want to add anything okay let's move to field single option all right over here you can see business theme so let's say the business theme is of like 50 just for now so I'm done I put up the payments for single option and I'm just going to click over here on save setting I'll go to my dashboard I'll view my form and you can see now the price has been added up over here and this is how the prices are appearing all right now let's see if I click over here on purchase this plan it will take me to a page where it will ask me to put up the details like name last name email card number the details and I can click over here on checkout to continue with my purchase all right so this is how actually you can create a form and you can choose the merchant setup like paypal or stripe and you can connect it and further you can put up the price plans accordingly and this is how you can collect payments now in my next video i'll be discussing about the recurring payment so till then enjoy creating forms and if you have got any queries or difficulties regarding these steps that i just explained to you just put up your queries in the comment box and i'll be there to help you Thanks so much for watching.